Hello and welcome back. This is Double Debbie and this is episode 13 of my experimental Alpha 17, Seven Days to Die Let's Play. Um, I have been in here um, working on replacing these. I accidentally upgraded that one ah, with cement. <laughs> Bonkers. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I, I plan on eventually um, replacing these with these uh, blocks and possibly putting another set on the outside, at least on the second tier, because that seems to be the most commonly um, damaged block. Yeah, so uh, that's what I've been doing. Um, so we probably don't need to do that. I'll try to work on that, but hopefully it won't ever come down to them getting inside our base and killing our dudes. Oh, you kidding me? Open up already. Did you hear it? It it actually opened up. Oh, I was born in a barn. Okay, so what do we got planned for today? It's the day before the horde. Dun, dun, dun. And I can't remember where everything's at. <laughs> uh, I do, I did, I was downstairs digging some too. Uh, and, whew, that's wrong. I don't know where I'm at. Uh, so that's my shovel. We need to put this away. I think that's my spare axe. Although I don't know how I got a tier 1 axe when I think I... I think I must have melted or scrapped my tier 3 one. But that's okay. This is only a backup. Uh, oh, dude! Oh. Okay, we're down here. Let's go ahead and uh, throw the iron in. Should we get started? Let's get this iron started. Let's only do five. There's not a whole lot there. I'm carrying some iron around with me. Uh, through the night, I was, uh, I did dig some more down here. Uh, this whole section was mostly gravel. Um, I do think it's, uh, I did get some more nitrate, as you saw. <laughs> no iron. The only iron I get is basically the one or two I get from busting the stone. So, uh, yeah, I was really hoping for some iron, but I didn't get it. Uh, but I did get a ton of stones and was able to make another thousand concrete mix. Yay! Um, we don't have any more currently going. So let's, let's make that happen. Um... I may need to uh, we may need to go and make a little um, dugout to get sand because uh, I don't like working out in the open. <laughs> I think it'd be a little bit safer and we might get protected from the heat if we go underground. Uh, heat is definitely a thing. We're gonna put uh, our concrete up here. All right, let's go put this other stuff upstairs. Can't, it can't be mixed with our concrete. Ugh. Come on. <laughs> um, 
Yeah, I think I was going to put this down here or up here, but I decided I wanted to put it down there and I don't change my mind. Is this our tool? Yeah, this is our tool. Oh my goodness, that sounded like a sleeper. Oh, but she's probably gonna die on her spikes. I heard her. Oh, she is banging on the fence? What the crap? She just go around. Now she's not. Where did she go? Where did she go? Oh, there she is. And she died. Nope. Uh, now she died. Ah, uh, I die. <laughs> just for good measure. <laughs> Let's make sure. Oh! Tubby! Oh my god! There's another screamer all the way out there. It's hard to adjust for the movement. Let's go up a little. Ha ha ha! We gotcha. Oh, I didn't adjust for the move, the, the distance. I didn't adjust for the distance again. Tubby can get through there. There we go. We need to put those landmines in. Don't you? <sighs> he almost did it. He almost did it. Look at that. She hit the fence, but then she went around. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, dude. That's going to kill me. It's going to get me killed one day. I just know it. <laughs> Um, two screamers, yeah. Turning on the the forges, we we'll draw them in, and plus we cleared out all of that um, the grass around here, so that didn't help either. So what I want to do? We got some frames. Um. gonna need some ladders we don't need to go down very far maybe we'll just make tiers um we'll do five again I like that uh, and we need a hatch there we go um Easy peasy. And possibly we might want to take some drinks. Uh, I don't think I have any right now. So we'll just take some regular water. Yeah, I think that'll be okay. Uh, we just need sand. We need tons of sand. Uh, what I want to do is go over to this dirt patch. Uh, I don't know if it offers more uh, protection from the sun, but it will uh, give us a little bit more protection, maybe, I think. Right. 
see, because this takes two hits to break. I don't know. It might uh, not offer us more protection from like, being broken, but I think it will give us more stability uh, than like the sand. Sand has less of a strength to carry other blocks. So we might be less likely to have a freaking cave in. I noticed even um, while I was digging uh, down in the, the under there last night uh, that I had some gravel fall. Uh, I was like... <coughs> Seriously, it's right next to other gravel. Why is it falling? I don't get it. I don't get it. Ah! Let me down. There we go. I don't know what happened, but I think it was sort of stuck in the, the hatch. So that wasn't good. And as you can see, this is like a sand gravel. We're getting rock and sand, but this is one hit. This isn't like the other gravel in our, in our biome. This will actually um, one shot the sand. Uh, I can't one shot the gravel over there yet. Uh, so that's a thing. <laughs> Okay, that's going to be the floor. We're going to go out this way just a tad so uh, we can put our ladder up. Boink, 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 and boink. Awesome. So we should be able to go boink. And even though we have our roof here, um, uh, it's still going to have a layer of dirt so the zombies won't know the extent of our sand mine. Yes, that's a thing. Zombie knowledge. There we go. I like having the, uh, not having the dirt around the ladder because uh, you get stuck on it. Oh my god, it's so... Annoying. Yep. Um, now, I don't, I don't really know the strength of the sand. Like, how much uh, will it support before it starts falling? I mean, uh, I would like to support it without, um, you know, being overly supportive. <laughs> Is that a thing? Okay, we can put uh, this back. I don't know how deep the sand goes. Uh, all the way to like bedrock or is there um, going to be rock involved so there we go uh, we got our little entryway this is probably gonna be uh, I, I might even come over here at night depending on how safely I feel I, I don't know it's still gonna be exposed up top, so it might not be the safest thing. <laughs> so there is dirt above, but uh, I'm thinking uh, it's gonna have to be more than like three wide um, to be structurally unsound. But how much farther that's 
question. Okay, so our tunnel here is three wide. So let's go out to like five wide. Will it hold at five wide? It should. Uh, we're probably going to have to go away from our wooden blocks um, to get a good measure of it. And this is probably the wrong direction. Um, we want to be going the other way because this is actually towards our base, I believe. Yeah, well, you want to be digging this this way. Uh, we still got a good ways though to go. Um, so yeah, let's head over that way behind our little ladder down here. Uh, yeah. Do you want to cause a cave in? Yes, I do. It's purely for educational purposes, though. I don't want to really cause a cave in. I just want to know how far can I go before I cause a cave in with sand? Is it a thing? Look at all the stuff we're getting! This is awesome. <laughs> Look at all the sand and we're getting rocks too. That's awesome. And it's all easy one hit. Oh, that's so awesome. Okay. So we're probably going to have to go away from this. And um, we are what did we, we are underneath um, the dirt. So that might be giving it more of a um, structural boost than uh, the sand would have. Um, that's what I wanted, but only for here. I want, I want to see... We're probably going to have to get away from this too because this will support, what was it, um, like 80? But that's for the wood frame. No, it's 40. It will support like eight uh eight other blocks before it will fall but i think that's actually a lot less um i think it's the um the difference between a wood frame and a wooden block uh, because this is just the wood frame. When you upgrade it, I think it might give some more support. Um, but there's no way to tell because I can't pick up a wood block. Uh, maybe it would be similar to this. But that's made in a table. Uh, Maybe it would be similar to all these other wood blocks. Um, let's see, what is a wood bar? We can make a wood bar. It probably has similar hit points. Oh, it looks like the same. Uh, five mass, 40 support. Okay, well, let's go ahead and scrap that. Uh, so yeah, uh, maybe the wood block is the same structurally, um, probably it has more hit points than the wood frame, but it looks like it's still the same, uh, structurally, uh, speaking as the wood frame. I always thought it would be more supportive, um... Uh, you know what I mean? Now we can uh, branch these off as well and go side to side. 
in either direction uh, parallel to our build, our bait, um, and still run into uh, tons of desert. Oh yeah, out of stamina. Dang. Look at that, 765. I want to get uh, a little bit more so we have a thousand sand because that's what we're going to need to go with our uh, thousand cobble that we put in the furnace. Um... You know what? Uh, yeah, let's get the thousand sand, and it's it's day thirteen. It's unlucky thirteen. Uh, <laughs> but I've always been, you know, superstition is like all in your head. So I don't think thirteen is really as unlucky as uh, you know it's been purport, reported to be. So we're going to go on an adventure. We're going to head over to that rally point and see what's up. Uh, maybe uh, since we've seen that some of these uh, dungeon type things uh, actually have ferals at the top so maybe we'll get smart <laughs> and we'll take like um, a shotgun to deal with that for when we get to the tippy top of where <laughs> of where our rally point is we can deal a little bit better because I'm not so good with runners I don't like them. They, especially in the, the Alpha 16, where they would run around in a circle. Oh, they were so fast, and they would just run around in a circle. You couldn't do anything to them. They stink. <laughs> I don't like it. All right. So five seems to be pretty stable. We're probably still. Close enough uh, that the wood is actually supporting it. I think sand has a much lower structural integrity than wood. So it might, like, the wood can support eight, it says. Uh, oh, I need more wood frames. Oh, there's our thousand. Okay, we got a thousand. That's good. Uh, we can go play any old time. Uh, so, yeah, as soon as we come out, bam, we're hot. So that is offering a little bit of protection being underground. That's good to know. That is good to know. Oh. Yeah, getting that heat buff, plus I left my headlight on. Uh, everything just sort of got washed out. Oh, maybe my uh, gamut is a little bright for being in the desert. Uh, yeah, it's on 100. Let's put it down to like 80. Ah, oh, that's close enough. It just seemed, just coming from the desert, man, that just seemed so bright. <laughs> Having that, uh, that heat buff made everything just all washed out and stuff. Okay, so, well, we have sand, but the sand doesn't go down there. So let's put the sand over here. 
sand, dirt. We'll actually put our building blocks down here as well. We can also leave our nail gun and the chubble. And we'll probably take a wrench, although I don't. Let's, let's leave a bunch of this wood. Although I'm, you know, I'm going to keep... Um, my inventory on death. <laughs> Do we have any more food? Oh, good. That will help. We'll take a little bit of food, a little bit of water with us. Let's get like one more water since this isn't the good stuff. Our crops haven't started yielding um, fruit yet. <laughs> so. That's a thing. Um, we've got plenty of arrows. We want to grab our wrench and the shotgun. Oh, we brought our guns up here last time, didn't we? Uh, this shotgun has more oomph. So we're going to put it for our hunting knife because we only use the hunting knife to skin things. Uh, we're going to need our ammo. So little buckshot. Uh, you know what? I'm going to leave the plant fiber because I don't think we need it to... for anything. And I'm going to carry the wood because we might need wood frames for whatever reason. Maybe we'll just it doesn't matter how much. Uh, uh, we will take our knife in case we see an animal. We'll be able to take care of it. Oh, my spare tools. I'm, I'm trying to get my wrench and I'm going downstairs because that's where it used to be. And we're also going to need our bike. Our bike. Okay. Now this rally point is pretty far away, but we're early in the morning. It's day 13. I think we'll do okay. Uh, we should be back plenty of time um, to do whatever we want. I believe. I don't know. It's two and a half kilometers, but it's off in a direction that we haven't yet explored. So it's sort of um, over here. Wow, look at all that. There it is. Wow. Yeah. So that's all the way up there. We, I think we're going to have to go through this town, which is going to be cool. We can kind of scope it out. Uh, Maybe we'll see like a blueberry patch. I don't know. Um, all right, so let's get let's get going. Um, we could actually make a a motorized bicycle, a mini bike. Uh, we have engines now, so that's good. And batteries. I think it's an engine, batteries, more tires, um, and whatnot. Okay, this road is is going in the direction that we need. So let's just follow the road. Follow, 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 follow the road. It's going to be uh, less trees to hit and whatnot. Oh, there's a car. It's so hard to not jump off and loot things. Oh, we're going to have probably tons to loot. Oh, are we going to be able to get up that? Oh, we did. I don't think that zombie's having as much luck, though. It's the bad thing about uh, the bikes is that you can't loot as easily. Look at that. 
Uh, there's a funky little water patch there. Wasn't as bad as the other town where it splits the road. <laughs> it splits the, the lake, it parts the water. And there's like 10 foot tall water. Uh, it's kind of funny. It's a little bug for Office 17 experimental. Oh, some core blocks. Uh, it's hard to pass those up. Oh my god, there's a backpack. Okay, this is the town that we sort of went in. How much further? Let's go. It looks like there's another town there. Um, let's go a little bit further north and see if we can find a road that goes to the east. And if we start getting close to it uh, and we don't find a road, we'll just... What was that? Did you see that? Some sort of, like, video glitch. Psh. Uh, this is a pretty nice looking town. They got some... It looks like uh, some bigger buildings, not just housing. What is that? Oh. Nice. There's a laundry mat, a hardware store. Ooh, um, we like hardware stores. Uh, we're gonna say hardware. It's, it's in that general vicinity. Yeah, that's pretty nice. A pawn shop. Jail. But this road sort of goes to the east. There's um, a weird intersection of roads. Another hardware store. Oh! Dinner. Oh, I missed. Oh, he's still. Sorry, booby. The girl's gotta eat. Got the power attack. So, 23 meter Roonies. Yum. <laughs> we'll break for dogs. Okay, I thought maybe that road was going east, but it's going southeast, as you can see there. So, if we don't see something heading over to the east, uh, we'll just cut cross country, I guess. Look, so now it's going east ish. East ish? That's a direction, isn't it? Oh, now it's. Uh, Going back to the north. All right, let's just get that water. Let's just go uh, head on, I guess. Oh, here's another body of water. We don't want to go in there. Don't want to go swimming. Oh, there's a little doe. I don't, I don't like having to chase chase my dinner. Oh man, Mikey, you're taking so much damage. I don't like being up on this hill though. We'll sort of go towards the bottom, circle around it. I hear you, but I'm busy. I got a rally point to go to. Oh, wow, we're a lot closer than I thought. It's less than so. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, look, I'm still, I'm still on it. Pick it up. You can do it. You can ride in the water. You can ride in the water. Oh, that's so amazing. Oh, okay, whew. 
You can ride in the water. That is what? I think that's um something about maybe chunks loading. It just sort of pops up a different Oh, there's another deer. Jeez. I just don't like having to run all over the place. What if I miss my shot? And then it takes me like 10 minutes to kill one baby little doe. But I think those are so weak. I think I can one shot them now, but I really need to get uh, the surprise on it. Look at this. There's like a whole new town. I guess you really need a, a town to have a rally point because it's like a little a dungeon type thing. So it's good to check out those rally points. You could lead you to some nearby towns that you didn't know about. You could uncover them on your map for you. It's pretty awesome. Uh, there's a cool looking building that I haven't seen before. Lots of cars. Looks like we need to go this way. What's that building? Um, oh, there's a passing gas. Those are good. That's a grocery store. The jail for all the delinquent zombies. Uh, Look at that building, that's humongous. I hope that's not the building we have to go into. Oh my God, that would be crazy. Yeah, let, let me get off my bike and pick my bike up and we'll have a little chat. Little Zomberts. I want to see what that building was. Let's go just, uh, I know our rally point is over there, but what is this building? It's freaking huge. Oh, it's the theater. Okay. I think it's pro, whoa. Uh. I think they meant it when they said stay out. One. One for Hammy. Hammy the Hammy. Oh, she's down. I think it's this place that it wants us to go to. It says stay out! Sounds like a bad idea. Um, maybe it's not it. I haven't seen the rally point update. Whoa! Beware dog. Uh, snake, pig, man. Uh. That doesn't sound good. Okay. Um, we're going away. This is like going... Oh, now we're getting... What? I'm getting puzzled. <laughs> Knock you on the noggin, bud. Oh, I missed. Miscalculated. Sorry. Being inefficient with my stamina. I'm hoping it's this house. It's getting further away. That's weird. 66. And now it's getting further away. Is it over this way? This is further away. Oh man, this isn't looking good. Looks like, um, looks like we're gonna have to go to this one. Although a rally point didn't update. Look at that. Be careful. 
Where's the landmine? There it is. It updated finally. All right, where's our um, rally point thumaflage? Let's steer clear of the edge so we don't get explodiated. Oh, look at that. Free deer. Um, let's take our pickaxe off. <laughs> I'll take that free meat. Thank you. I don't see the... Is it maybe in that tree or something? Let's circle around. I'm pretty sure it's this building. I don't like this ominous sign. This could be a bad, bad idea. Oh, there it is. Okay. Um. Let's use hammy. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I heard a zombie, uh, but I guess he's been taken care of. There's a... Uh... Yeah, let's get down here. I wanna, I wanna put, um, I wanna have a little stairway, a little escape. I don't wanna be down in the tunnel and be stuck and have to retreat. We're gonna, oh, we're not ready. Okay, number seven is our little. Oh, it took, took my stuff. What the heck? It also replaced that. <sighs> I've been robbed, robbed of my, uh, Oh my god, that was a bunch of lag. Oh, that's not good. Come on. There and there. That's all I need. That's all I need. I don't need this garbage. Oh, this is bad. Oh my goodness. That's a dog. the White River supplies. Is there another dog? Not over there. Let's get him off. This is so scary. Yeah. Right, the freaking schnauzer. I think we woke somebody up. 
Oh, that doesn't sound good. They're all awake. I know they're gonna come drop down on me. Maybe I should wait? Oh, I don't want to go up there and get the, just clobbered. Come on. Can you find your way down? Oh, that's so scary. Is that like a board from the outside? And the airdrop. Yeah, okay. We're still within. Oh, man. All right, hammy time. Hammy time. Out of stamina. Hello. I die. Okay, let's go get our arrows back. Get my arrows. Okay. Oh, I'm so relieved that that wasn't like inside the house. Oh, there must be, is there some more on the other side? Because that didn't seem like a, a full horde. Oh. No, I don't want to stay that close to the house. Are you kidding me? Okay, we're still within. I can see. Okay, the horde, I, I would like that to go get them, but... They're moving away from the house and we have to stay within or we could fail. So let's go back in. Hopefully all of them will have skedaddled. Let's go into sneaky, sneaky mode. We're not going to be very sneaky, sneaky with our hammer of doom out though. Uh, we're 26 down in food. We can't jump up on this ladder while we're sneaking, though. Uh, <laughs> so we're going to be not sneaky, sneaky. Whew, okay. We're up. We're in. Uh, let's go have a look about. I really... Hey, not I, I think that's a cubby for dudes right there. <laughs> this this thing. Seriously, there's nothing in there. Okay. Oh! Ah! No! Stop the bandage. Stop the bandage. Stop the bleeding. That was the pig. Doesn't look like this. Where's that coming from? It's coming from outside. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
there's a dog back there too. Oh, they're outside. Okay, it looks like there's a dog out here. I can see him over there. Can I hit him from here? It's going to be really hard to uh, get in that. Oh, we got him. Success. like uh is this a wind is this a door that we <laughs> have me time up here or something to this is the throne <laughs> this is the throne room so you can uh, survey all that you own. There is, um, that is awesome. I can see you. Oh, <laughs> yes. I love it. Oh, he's coming. remember to go a little bit above him because he's so far away. Ah. Yeah. I like this throne room. It looks like the whole thing is clear up here. Um, of up here of Zombert. So I'm going to leave the throne. Normally I would destroy the chair. This is a pretty well fortified area. We've got to find the supplies. It says we're like really close. I do still hear shuffling. We find a cooler intact with one water. Uh, we might as well loot while we're up here, right? Except that, um, we could become encumbered or I hear breathing. I don't know if that's uh, zombies on the in or the outside. Uh, we're going to go ahead and scrap, 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 get rid of. 
we got our uh, basic metals, our duct tape, our cloth, our oil. We don't need anything else. What did we get? We got hit. We got hit by Piggy. That sounds like somebody's getting angry and destroying things. I don't see them. This side is vulnerable. We'll take that glue, a little brass. It's easier to hold the, the raw brass. Ooh, the corn and a moldy bread. We don't really need the corn seed, so if we have to, we'll actually we'll get rid of it now. Because uh, I think we got a few empty plots, but I can get those at home. A sandwich. Dude, I hear you walking. I know you're there. Are you in? Oh, yeah. I'm afraid that, uh, oh, nice. I'm afraid that those zombies are going to come in and destroy it. Oh, that was really nice. And I saw that there was a bag up here. Nice. Some pants. Okay. Okay, bad things are freaking happening. I think there's another horde. <laughs> oh, he dropped a bag. Can we get it? Surprised it didn't explode. <laughs> I said I was surprised it didn't explode and it ex exploded right after I looted it. So, oh my gosh. Okay. We can do this. Oh. <laughs> think where are the supplies okay we're going away from the supplies uh, we know what's over there I think it's in here oh, I really hate going in these close quarters like that uh, now we're going away is it behind one of these Aha! We found it. Success! We still gotta clear. Whoa! Let's just go in and power attack this piggy. Whoa! That's probably not the smartest thing. I believe that's the way we came in. Uh, so, ooh, a suitcase. Um, let's go ahead and eat since we're down a little, and we're probably thirsty too by now. Oh wait, thirsty. Okay. Military.
Yeah, buddy. Um, what about these pants? They have more cold resist. We'll keep them. Because I don't know that we have very many pants. I think we have... Oh, some soup. We already filled up. Okay, we found that. We got tons of stuff to loot. We don't need to power attack this. Save our stamina. Okay, did we we didn't look in here when I mean, we did, but nothing behind there. Um, we're already pretty full of stuff, so we're not gonna wrench anything because that's gonna that's gonna give us too many things. I was really surprised that we didn't have like a pharaoh, but at the same time, pleasantly happy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like the barrels. They're mean. They're mean to me. Oh, that's not a medicine cabinet. I feel robbed. Toilet water. No um, bathtub bones. All right. Um, there was the laundry room in here. Maybe you can take apart those little bath laundry baskets. Uh, I believe we have a hat. We're gonna scrap that. We got plenty of hats. Nothing in here. Oh, the kitchen, baby! Oh, no matter what, that middle block is gonna go. Let's do the kitchen. Let's go to the kitchen. Let's go see what they got for us to eat. A can. Mm, not very promising. Another can. But they do have soup, so that's good. Soup is on. Some water. Excellent. Dye. Uh, dye solvent. It's not even really dye. It's to undye things, I think. The stove! An egg is useful and it stacks. So, a can. No microwave. The sink. Uh, we're gonna scrap the pipe. Garbage. Oh. Oh, no room in the queue. Oh, because the brass. The brass takes so long. I mean, oh no. What the heck? S something's in my sock. It's like it's a cat claw or something. It pushed into my toe, and my, my toes are very, very sensitive right now. Have we. We came this way. It looks like there was, um... Oh, it's 15 o'clock. Holy cow. We're gonna scrap that. Let's, uh... <gasps> Empty? Seriously? Let's not go through the door. It's rubbish. Scrap you. These are outside walls. Usually the there won't be anything behind it if it's on an outside wall. But we're gonna break them just to make sure. Was that everything? I don't think we got anything from the outside. Uh I didn't loot anything else here. And I did see that there was like a washing machine here to be did a couple of tra um like a pitfall into the nether region. Um yeah, what we can make those. Yeah. 
and take the glue. Okay, uh, we're encumbered. No! I know I should have looted all this stuff as I went, but I really, I don't like being encumbered while I'm fighting, so I try to save that. Uh, I try to save that for after. <laughs> it's okay to be encumbered now. Oh, a pain peel. Nice. Uh, some more iron arrows. That's really good. I haven't made arrows in a while. We're not going to take apart the bed. It doesn't. There's a little bit of trash and we'll scrap that and make these arrows. We're almost we almost used up all those feathers that we looted. Excellent. That should clear up another spot. A duke. That didn't. Oh, we didn't do this back. I still hear the pitter patter of little feet. That's. Oh! <laughs> That's where the noise was coming from. The vulture was trapped inside. Okay, we already been up to the rooftop and we looted it. So it's time to skedaddle, I think. Um, I know there's a minefield out here. <laughs> Probably not the best idea to go out on the minefield. Haha! -ha. Gotcha. Okay. Bye. Uh, Alright, let's go to the trader. And because we're really smart. Oh yeah. Now I hope I don't um uh, now that freaking um airdrop is going to be around here. See there it is. But we don't have room for anything. <laughs> we don't have room. So we're going to have to go uh we might have time enough to run back and get that airdrop um before nightfall, oh my god. Oh, we gotta hurry. Luckily we got the bike and we're, we're not as restricted on our movements as we normally would have been. Um, it looks like this road intersects with the other one eventually. So maybe we'll go, this should be a lot easier going if we go down the road. I think that's the, that's the 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 dream anyway. <laughs> Hopefully the road is uh not janky. I think it needs to be smoothed out. Like some of these hills aren't very, you know, I wouldn't see a real road um, doing all these janky, uh, janky little ups and downs, it would tend to be more, more of a slight angle than a steep angle. Oh, there's, there's some garbage. <laughs> what I'm full. Okay, looks like this is the intersection, and it is. If we did spin a little bit more patient, we wouldn't have had to go cross country. Oh my God, there's a bear, a undead bear, but we are in, oh no, please be attacking the freaking zombie. There's zombies behind me. I don't have to run faster than the bear. I just have to run faster than the zombie. And I can't look behind me because I don't know what key to push to uh, get it to 
use the 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 arrow or the movement keys to steer instead of the mouse. So right now I have to steer with my mouse. Even though I check the the key binds, it is bound to the steering of the vehicles is bound to the um, the movement keys, not the mouse. So I don't really know. Um, I don't really know what to do. Okay, now we're back to the town. All is good. We can follow the road, I think. Can we just follow the road back to town? Yeah, pretty much. We just need to follow this road. Should be smooth sailing. We get back to Basie. Ooh. Oh, look. I'm somehow steering with both now. So, if I'm holding down the shift key, no, no, no. I thought, I thought it had switched over to the keys, but now it's not doing anything. You know, I think I messed up on the, whoa, on the, the generate, the map generation, and I didn't get a random world, uh, because this is like the exact same world as my my first game, which I haven't played uh, since I started this one. I think it is. It looks like the town that I start near is uh, the same one. I can't be 100% certain. Although I did... I, I settled in a, a POI in that. Whoa! I went airborne. Did you see that? Yeah, this is all janky. With the this, this steep slopes like that. I mean, some of them weren't bad, but uh, some of them are pretty bad. Like this one. That one's stupid steep. Okay, it looks like, uh, yeah, we're close to town. We can probably start cutting across now. Oh, and we're out of stamina. Uh, oh my gosh. So we're almost there. We're going to go ahead and throw this stuff into our base. Oh no, I destroyed the garbage. And and then we're going to go run and get, try and get that airdrop. It's 17 o'clock. I don't know if we can get over there and back. It is a pretty long trek. Oh, we're slow again. Look, it looks like all our crops are good and ready to harvest. Ugh. Ugh. I can't do it anymore. Yeah, I don't know that we'll have time to get over there and back. No, because we don't have to worry about runners until 22 o'clock. Um, didn't I designate one of these as the cell chest? This is the new cell chest. Those things need to get sold. And that will be where our money resides. 
Okay, we got um, some meat to put up and fat and eggs and cans of soup. Oh, we gotta go to the trader. Oh, this this can go in in the food. Oh, we got another shab sandwich. Fix that up later. What's weird is you can't you can't move that package once it's in your inventory. It doesn't go anywhere. All right. Um. Oh yeah, the soup goes over here because that can be eaten. It doesn't make anything else. Um. Boom. Nope. You don't go there. Uh, we got a pill. Oh, we also got two coffee. What are we doing? That's enough to make another seed. Uh, did we have them? Yeah, this is the miscellaneous chest now. Okay, um, this one. Bones, paper, leather, cloth duct tape, glue, oil. We have weapons and ammo up here now. So that should... Give, oh, yes. And we forgot. This goes in there. Uh, weapons. Got another SMG, baby. And assault rifle 2. Yes. Oh, uh, ammo gets feathers and ammo. This stuff goes down. And let's just keep it on us. We gotta go to the trader and turn in this quest. Um, you know what, we've already, let's, let's go ahead and get the airdrop, and if we have time, we'll run over to the trader real quick. Uh, we'll follow the road, because that's the less, uh, the least obstructive path. There, there probably will be, like, pebbles on the road, but we can avoid them. Um... Can I drink? Oh, we saw, I saw in one of my games that, uh, I don't know if they fixed it or not, but if you drank while you were, I was like riding a bicycle through the desert. I was overheated and I was trying to drink to get rid of it. And I drank like four or five drinks and it didn't, it didn't affect my, used it up. But as you can see, it doesn't make your thirst go up at all. So we have to get off. There we go. Now we're not thirsting. Um, we're not on the road. <laughs> we're not on the road. We're not. We're on the road, but we're not on the. Oh, nerds! Did you see that? Oh my goodness, that was not good. Okay, there's a lake there. I know we're gonna hit the road. Sort of. We're sort of running parallel to the road. We need to go more east. You know, um, now that we're, actually we're, um, we're heading, pro let's just go cross country. The road's only going to take us a little bit further out of the way. And right now we need, we need to get there as quickly as possible. And here's a little road. Uh, if we go through the town, we should be able to go along mostly roads, hopefully. And we're out of stamina again. So yeah, you can't drink while you're on a bike. I haven't tested the food, 
Uh, but right now, my food is still so... Here's a construction site. My food is still so... Whoa! There was a little... Uh, you switch... Switcheroni. Where you hit like a... I think it's a zone boundary. You hit them just right. It causes like a little video glitch. Uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go to the airdrop. Because we're really smart. I think... Uh, I think my next points, I'm definitely going to have to, to try and get to uh, the pack mule. It's such a pain being encumbered. It's so painful. Get so slow. So slow. Of course, don't be silly. You can't have it in a normal biome. It has to be in a charred biome. Watch, this is going to have like 65 million different items in it with all of them just like one one can of soup one bottle of water one one bottle of uh <laughs> one bottle of toilet water one empty jar one empty can one can of soup one can of pasta Oh no, not a vulture. I hate the stinking vultures. I really do. Oh, are you stupid vulture? I don't see it. Did you see that? That was awesome. Oh! Seriously! Seriously, you want to do this? Why did it. How is it possible that it was in my face and I missed? Well, come on! You little. Seriously! I am missing this little oh douchebag. I'm taking your bones. <laughs> Turd head. See why I hate them? I mean they were like in my face, I swing and I miss. How is that even possible? Alright, now all we have to do is get back to base. We should be able to do that. It was totally worth it. Did you see that? A level six marksman rifle. That is so awesome. I love, I love the sniper rifle. It says marksman. There's a backpack. I passed it a while ago, but I'm gonna loot it. Oh. Totally worth it. <laughs> totally worth it. But yeah, a level six marksman rifle. That is awesome. I love it. It's definitely gonna gonna be a keeper there. That's like the first marksman rifle I've seen, and it's a level six. Um, um, I might need to get to a road or something. I might jump off and and have a little bite to eat because I'm, uh, I'm. Yeah, let's get get off here. Um, bind our wounds. Um. I am going to eat my bacon and eggs because I don't want food poisoning on the road. 
Yeah, there we go. All right, let's continue. That should give us a little bit more stamina to use while we're riding so we can sprint longer. Oh, I didn't see the rock. Oh, I didn't see the zombie. Oh my God. All the trees. That's why the road is good. There's no trees in the way. It's 19 o'clock. I believe we're going to get there in time. We'll be able to... Let's just go to the trader directly. Ah, ah, ah. I think we're still pretty far away. Yeah, let's go up here and get on the main road. Take the main road down till we're a lot closer. <sighs> biome, sweet biome. I love this uh, biome a lot better than the chard or the desert. It's a, a little bit more temperate to my liking. Don't have to worry about uh, switching clothes as much. Hello, Mr. Zombie, out for a stroll. It's a nice, nice day, isn't it? So you get to the charred biome. Oh! That's where we went airborne last time. I think that's making my thing take, my bicycle take damage. That's not right. Shouldn't take damage going up a hill, should you? Ooh, ooh. Now I can see going down a hill like that <laughs> taking damage. Okay, we're close enough. We're to our we're to our town. We're just gonna go straight across. We're out of stamina again. <sighs> um there are so many points to spend. I really, I really can't decide which is more important. Is it more important to do damage or is it more important to have stamina? And I'm starting to think that the stamina is going to be like, it's the driving force behind your damage. If you don't have stamina, you can't do the damage. Also, I think the, I think it was the distance, like the hammer can reach so much further than, uh, you know, a normal weapon that I think it was just swinging past the buzzard. So, uh, nope, I think it might be better to uh, have a, Close melee weapon like a dagger or a mace. A club. Oh, the lag. Okay, now we gotta talk to the trader. Hey, Jackass, can I lighten that backpack up for you? Oh, yeah. Congratulations. Oh, I didn't Here's bring the stuff to sell. Sucker. Five first aid kits. Nice. Or 11 pipe bombs. I think I can't make the first aid kits yet, I don't think. Uh, but I can make the pipe bombs. So I think I'm going to take the first aid kits. Do you have any jobs? Oh, look. We got a close one. It's only a, it's only a freaking kilometer. Oh, but there are buried supplies. I think I want to do that one. I don't like you. What are you standing there for? Oh, don't up. you have work to do? <sighs> Does he have anything that we even might be interested in? Uh, night vision goggles, but we don't have enough money. I don't know how much I got at home, but night vision goggles you can't wear. I guess you can't wear with like a SWAT helmet. Um, no, it's the scrap helmet because it like covers your face. 
so you don't get to wear the night vision goggles but i think it might be okay with the swat helmet um know what i mean uh but we don't have the money for that anyway so Ooh, there's some air filter landmines. Those are 518 each, so no thank you. A wrench, a bucket, a claw hammer, yeah, none of that stuff looks interesting. They do have some lucky goggles. I don't I have lucky goggles, I don't remember what I think I did put the goggles on because it gives you better loot. The loot bonus. And yeah, he just doesn't have anything. It would be really good to find another trader. Let's look. What Do we have the goggles? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, so we did get the military leg armor. I think it might be time. So all we need is like some boots good um yeah so we might want to go and repair those up yeah let's just run we don't need to get bikey out we're right over the hill So that was uh that was a good run we did have uh some stuff to sell uh it's 20 o'clock this is where normally in the episode we had we went and cleared the rally point we did the stuff and things we we were successful we killed the, the evil dogs and the pigs and we were successful we did not die which is good there was no um there was no feral dudes in there. There were landmines and stuff. So that's no good. I wonder if you could pick those up. That would be interesting. <laughs> if I could just pick them up to loot them. I know that, no, I guess not, probably. Anyway, uh. We're going to call the episode here. Thank you for watching. We will see you next time. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, it really does help. So we'll see you next time for the 14-Day Horde. Bye-bye.